The Young Artists Club is a group of 14 to 18 year olds from Angus who come together and use Hospital Field as a point of inspiration to explore creativity in all of its scope. What is art? Art, I suppose, it can be whatever you want it to be, but I think my definition would be sort of inviting people into your head and expressing things that you could never really see before or taking something everyone sees every day and giving it an entirely new meaning. I think a lot of them had a real interest in art but it was an, an art form that was maybe more directed by what they learned at school and so I think what they got from it was a broader sense of what being creative, being an artist, being a designer could be. Well, for me, it's about giving space to young artists to be creative about whatever they want. Well, I like art because I'm, I'm really bad at like doing things with like, I can't like voice my opinions very well or, or like write things super well either. So art is just a way to like let out how I feel and, and just be who I am, but like in a different way. I think my intention, or my hope at least, was that they would come to Hospital Field and feel like it was a space for them. Yeah, I wanted them to have ownership over what they were making, um, the space that we're in, about how the programme evolved, um, because that was, that's more meaningful, I think. When you're young like this, normally the only opportunities you get to express are, are in school, and of course they're all graded, and they really matter towards everything. But this, of course they matter more emotionally, but it's just freedom. You can do whatever you want. And that is really, as an artist especially, it's really rewarding. A few years ago, I was in their position and was doing like that sort of stuff out with school. And I think it helped me so much to get into uni and to like learn what I like doing. So doing this was like my first time kind of leading workshops and like being an arts educator rather than being the person being educated. The past year and a half in COVID and everything, I suffered really bad burnout. So it was just kind of a good outlet to just be able to just be creative for five hours a day or four hours a day, really. It's just, there's a sense of community that I really enjoy about Art Club. Would any of you know each other before? Um, a couple of us. We go to school together, but that's it. Yeah. I didn't know anyone, but no. now, like, yeah, we see each other outside of this as well and yeah. stuff. So. so I proposed the idea of a manifesto to them through sharing how other artists use this as a way of them understanding their own practice. A manifesto is, you see them a lot in politics and art, it's uh, basically just a short piece of writing about your goals, your morals, anything you believe in that you want to tell other people. Okay, what's in your manifesto? It says, um, have fun, that's one of them. Um, be inclusive and respectful. Um, what were the other ones? No such thing as bad art. Like, make art for yourself, not yeah. for anyone else. There's no rules to anything. I think the highlight for me was just being in a community of people who equally appreciated art and being given so much creative freedom. I think they realised that there was something to learn from trying, trying new things. That kind of pressure of having to make art, but it has to be like perfect that pressure has been kind of taken away a little bit so I kind of want to make more art it was important to have an exhibition because they achieved so much and it was important to showcase that to their family so to have this huge um, presentation of things that they've made from start to finish was really important for them to show their families to show to kind of to show off, have a sense of pride in what they've achieved. Okay, I'm here.
here today um, to celebrate the past few months that my daughter's been attending the Young Artists Club. She has just blossomed through the whole process. She's learned so many new techniques and ways to appreciate art and she's really enjoyed it. I think when we reflect on the participants from the very beginning to the participants now, I would say that confidence and empowered is probably a really nice way of saying it. Because there's definitely been a, change, a shift. It's been really, really privileged to see and be part of that shift. Well, I think it's given me like the opportunity to apply to other things like it. Um, because normally I, I wouldn't like put myself out there and try new things um, with art, but since it's ended, I've like applied to a lot more different like youth art groups and like design things. Uh, this project has been absolutely wonderful for my daughter Ruby. I guess she had an, an unusual. She was in an unusual situation in that we moved house in a pandemic from England to Scotland. Uh, she wasn't at school. She was going to go to uh, uh, art college, but it was quite a big jump for her. So we moved in a pandemic and she had no friends. And she made such fantastic connections here. And it really gave her the confidence that she needed to go on and, and uh, go to college. Been given the opportunity to try new things and um, the opportunity to do things that she maybe doesn't get to do at school. So, um, and she's met a lot of really nice people and she's been really inspired, I think, by the whole the whole um, the whole group. So, just thoroughly um, delighted, and she's had a lovely time. I feel like it's also like given me a wider perspective of what I could do after uni. If you have an arts degree, you can do whatever you want with it. So now I know that I could also be an arts education. Yeah, this, this, is, this project has been absolutely pivotal in her life. It's no um, small thing to say, it's actually changed her life. I think Young Artists Club sort of, it inspired me to think about what I can do in the future, not what I should do. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, 